So over here, you can see that I have a character animator project and I have done a few things. So if I want to revert back onto a previous state, then what I can do is I can press Ctrl Z and then it goes back onto a previous state of the web. You can view the entire history of what you did in your project by going into Windows and by going into History. Once you do that, over here on the left side, you can see that uh, there's the start of the history itself. So there's nothing right there. So so if I were to go over here, then you can see that there's a new puppet that I added. I recorded performance. I then moved the recording and so forth. So I can choose around the step, a particular step that I want to work with right here. So just like this, the history will be saved. But the history uh, adds in a bit of memory so it, it takes up a bit of space so if you're absolutely sure that you do not need the history that is you do not need to undo out uh, any of the uh, steps then what you can simply do is you can go on to file and then you can click on clear history so once you click on it what happens is that it says that are you sure you want to clear the entire project and undo history and save all the versions and if you are absolutely sure that you do not need to undo out at all and the, the state is exactly what you need, then you can simply clear the history out and you can see that the undo history has been totally cleared out. So now if I were to press Ctrl Z, nothing happens. That is because there is no history saved out right there. And that is how you can work around with history and clear history option inside of Adobe Character Animator. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.